Some may still be new to this upcoming rapper, but DaBaby has had an amazing year. In fact, we can call 2019 his year. But some mistakes he's made may be catching up to him. Before we get into the video, make sure you watch until the end as you won't want to miss what we have to show you. Also be sure to subscribe to our channel, click that notification bell to be notified of all future content, and comment violence on this video to be entered in our iPhone XS giveaway. DaBaby has had tremendous success in a short period of time. However, as good as the year is, he seems to be leaving a trail of violence everywhere he goes. Is he about to sabotage his own success by going to jail? DaBaby is an American rapper born on December 22, 1991. His real name is Jonathan Linde Kirk. He was born in Cleveland, Ohio, but he moved to Charlotte, North Carolina when he was six. Like many other rappers, DaBaby grew up on the streets and had a pretty rough background. He grew up with two older brothers, and the presence of 50 Cent, Eminem, Lil Wayne, etc. were constant in his childhood. Even though music has always been a part of him, he started his music career in 2015. When he started his career officially, he chose the name Baby Jesus, a very awkward name, right? In 2015, he released Nonfiction, his debut mixtape, under the stage name Baby Jesus. Unfortunately, the project was not successful. He experienced a little break after he released his second mixtape, God's Work, Resurrected, in 2016. Between 2016 and 2019, he released several other mixtapes, working on several musical projects while waiting for his real major break. After using the stage name Baby Jesus for a while, he realized that the name Jesus did not properly align with his kind of music and lifestyle, so he switched to Da Baby, a more befitting name for his character if you ask me. The first major break he's been waiting for came after a big controversy. As they say in Hollywood, there's no bad publicity. Any publicity is good publicity. This line worked for Da Baby. His controversy led to his major break. On the 5th of November 2018, DaBaby was in the news for a murder case, the murder of a 19-year-old kid. Terrible news on a normal day, but not when you acted in self-defense. The kid allegedly attacked and tried to rob him at Walmart, and DaBaby shot him in self-defense. In March 2019, all charges against him were dropped, and DaBaby became an instant hit in the rap scene. An intelligent man, DaBaby used the attention which the news brought him to solidify his place in the music industry. Earlier this year, he signed with South Coast Music Group, and he also has a contract with Interscope Records, maintaining a joint contract with both labels. On March 1st, 2019, he released his debut album, Baby on Baby, and it has been a major hit. His song Sugar debuted at 87 on Billboard Hot 100. It later reached the top 10. The song has been streamed more than 60 million times on YouTube. With the string of success that DaBaby has been experiencing, however, he hasn't learned calmness or gentility with it. He has a trail of violence hanging on his neck, and it appears to be a major threat to his career. In January 2019, he punched a guy and knocked him out in the middle of a performance. Recently, in May 2019, a fan who was trying to take a picture with him was viciously attacked by DaBaby's crew. He was beaten black and blue, leaving him in need of serious medical attention. After the altercation, DaBaby stormed out of the show and refused to perform even though he had been paid $22,000 for the show. While the organizers of the show aren't furious, they are trying to amicably set up another concert for him to perform at, but the victim is furious and raging with anger. He wants to press charges, and he wants to go for blood. A few days after his crew attacked the man, he got into another fight with a fellow rapper from Charlotte, Cam Coldheart. While Coldheart has been trolling him on the internet for a while, it got very dirty and ugly when the two rappers found themselves in the same mall. The two rappers got into a verbal abuse, which soon degenerated into a fight. The result was DaBaby knocking Coldheart out, leaving him with his pants down and blood drooling from his nose. While Coldheart is claiming that he was attacked by multiple men, DaBaby is using this opportunity to gloat and flex his toughness. DaBaby is not someone new to arrests and run-ins with the law. From being arrested for driving with a revoked driver's license to illegal possession of marijuana, he has been arrested several times. He has also been arrested for the possession of a stolen firearm. However, with the recent fights he's been getting into, he may soon go down for harassment charges. Undeniably, things are smooth for him at the moment, but if care is not taken, his career may be brought to an abrupt end even before it fully starts. We think it's time DaBaby stopped acting like a baby and started acting like an adult. 
What do you think? Should the baby be more careful or are all of these acts justifiable? Let us know what you think in the comments. We have more scintillating and explosive content for you. Like this video, smash that subscribe button, and turn on the notification bell for more videos.